Let's take what comes in. Oh no, the knight takes. Don't matter about that. Yeah, okay. Let's just lean on the knight at the same token going here. And that's an interesting situation, isn't it? I'm going to bring the knight up. What I've got to stop doing is pushing the knight forward. I'm gonna, well, I'm going to take this because it's a free pawn. <laughs> so I'll push it forward for that. Um, queen's on me. Let's attack their knight. He's run all the way across here just to protect his king area. And it's um, had to take a little bit of a hit. Uh, rooks there. Uh, let's support this pawn for now before we... Instantly I'm like, oh, let's get up here. But we don't need to be doing that. Let's see what queen exchange might... Any consideration? Oh, they're taking too long. They're not going to... Yeah, they're not going to do it. Why don't people exchange their queens? It's annoying. I'm trying to sneak in here, but just leave the knight there. In fact, I could come here and then attack him again with the queen. Let's attack him again. Oh, let's attack a smaller piece. Yeah, so we're getting the queen now. Unless, of course, he comes down and does this. He's not doing that, he's attacking our queen. How unfair is that? Okay, let's keep the x-ray on the queen. Anything else? Um, now we can take the queen, or we can just block him. Pawn takes, pawn takes. Uh, let's just take the queen off the board. No, we're not doing that. Okay, so they're going to feel really good that they've got out of that little mess. Quite magical actually what they just did just then, but um, I'm not going to say anything. Let's bring the rook here. It's obviously bringing this pawn to attack the pawn. What sort of tricks have they got? Uh, okay, so we, I'm not going to bring the rook up. Like I said, he's still going to be coming with this. Back ranker might happen, so we need to give the king a fly square. Let's tack in the rook, so he doesn't like our rook being there. Interesting time. So we could hit his rook. But then we lose out, really, don't we? Because he gets the pawn. Um, okay, let's come here. What do we have? It's looking a little bit messy now. I've not got my rooks linked up. I think I'm going to be too late to the party. Oh, doesn't know what to do. Interesting. Let's get the rooks into the game then. That's a, that's allowed us to get here. I think they they had an advantage swinging this pawn here and stuff. Oh, they're just going backwards and forwards. So now we have a bit of a situation that we can maybe build on. We didn't before. King's still just moving around. I'm going to push this pawn up now then. I've got the knight supporting this pawn. Interesting times. So if we pushed here, he takes, then we take, then he takes our rook. <clears throat> yeah, that doesn't work. Yeah, I'm th thinking that the rooks are here, but they're not. Let's push up here. Time is running down, so they are moving faster than us. Oh, we're actually plus one. Didn't realize that. Um, let's just push this up. If, see if we can get our king up into the game. Or do we need to push? So we've got one pawn there, so bam, 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 we'll be on his rook. I'm going to push. Take on the rook. Everybody's protecting this. Um, Boom, pawn takes, pawn takes, knight takes, rook takes, rook takes, rook, we don't win that. Let's get in here, see if we can get rid of his knight. Uh, let's see if we can get rid of the knight. Do we go inwards to block the pawn if he does capture? I'm mindful that I'm trying to teach myself not to push my knight up there and get it trapped. <clears throat> it's 
So if he doesn't exchange, I could potentially come here, act as a blocker, check on the king. King can't come here for the pawn. And that's it, I think. It's kind of a draw, isn't it? Let's go here. Maybe looking to push the pawn up. Now I've got tunnel vision focusing on this area. Maybe that's wrong. I go one. I don't think he's going to take, is he? No, he's not taking. Let's push. It is a draw because I'm not moving from this spot, am I? Because he's hitting me twice on there. And if I push up, gets his king away. Take this and then his pawn is still down here. We have a passer, but it's not going anywhere. Uh, if we go here, he takes, we take, and then we've got two pawns facing the far flank. I don't think he's going to take, though. It's just locking it down. Yeah, it's just locking it down, which isn't right, is it? Let's just lock it down then. Put a check on. Uh, and he's still got the two... You can see he's still got the rooks there. So I'm going to spring the king here. Forty-four seconds, and I don't know if I don't think I can do it. If his rook takes, then we go up. up. I think he's got a check on. Got a check on. Let's come back here. Don't think I've got enough time to come around here and put a check on. It's just going to take our pawn off. I might have time, but I don't see it at the moment. Clicking that, but I can't. I'm going to have to move my head. There we go. Yeah, so. Might have been an unnecessary draw, but uh, let's have a quick shifty and see because time-wise, I, I didn't have time to try and risk it for a biscuit. Oh no, we're winning! We're winning! Oh, we're out and out winning! Oh dear! Isn't that gutting? Well, it's a good job it was only the tester. It's the last test one. But um, what a way to go out. Damn. Okay, so at this moment, it's, it's not that... We're not winning per se, but then it's plus one when he's bringing his king down. And we're pushing up. Pushing up. Getting our pawns highly elevated up the board. So that part looks nice, but... It just feels a bit drawish to me. It's willing to get this pawn taken. It's saying, basically it's saying, yes, you have time to go and mess them up. So maybe you should have gone with the idea of going around the back. But I've only got 44 seconds I'm, and they've got a minute and 13. I'm thinking I'm going to mess this up. Right, so brought the king across. So they did that. And so I... Um, Oh, then they brought the king across, so we put a check on. Yeah, we did have ideas of that, but then we were really talking about this move here. Okay, that's what I was thinking. Then I, I don't know about this poor move here. Um, human is not they're just going to take, aren't they? And obviously I'm going to take back, and then they take back. The idea was to be put leaning on the king here. But did they not just do this? Oh, shah, then obviously we would come here because we've got the outpost. But then they do that. And then we look for a pawn, which is all basic stuff. So now the rook can't come back to defend, but they can do their magic move. We go here. And what would they do? Okay, yeah, maybe they would do that. So then we capture. So we're gaining a pawn. Does the king come down as a human? Yeah, okay, let's do that. Does the rook go up? And I know this looks a bit fancy there, going across there, so I would have probably had a bit of a whoosh, and then it probably would have ended up being a draw, because I would have gone, mm, not happy with this. 
if we take I would have had like say 10 seconds left I'd have been panicking then it's a draw exactly yeah yeah so I think it ended up right you know at the end of the day if those movements were made um, if I'd gone that way um, I would have still ended up turning it into a draw because dropping it down here and stuff and all that with like 10 or 5 seconds left it's a little bit too squishy squishy yeah it's got the idea of putting a check on the king here and stuff but you need a lot more time to pull those types of moves off so definitely happy with the draw there